Salvete omnes, this is I'm Emilia, also known as the Martian Geek, and welcome back to another episode of The Legend of Heroes Trails in the Sky. In the last episode, we had a secret rendezvous with Julia and did some sneaking around. And now it's time to tackle the other half of the sewers. Just gotta go over here. They're a lot easier to find than the west block was, or the entrance is, rather. Well, let's see. Yeah. So we go over here, and then we go down here. Grantsel Sewers East Block. So, crab. More crabs. Got the petrify at a time when it wasn't useless, that's good. Well, good job missing the one I really wanted you to shoot. Probably should just be using magic on these, but whatever. Again, I really wish this game had maps for the dungeons. Thankfully, that's one thing that they changed in Trails of Cold Steel. Or maybe the Crossbell games, I guess I don't remember for sure if Zero had them. Okay, what's in here? Treasure chest. Full of monsters. Alright, so we have Mad Snails. I forget how many, which of these we've seen. I want to say all of them except the eggs, but... Let's see. So arts are ineffective on the eggs. How about staring at them angrily? Is that effective? Can I get more than five of them with this? Does not look like it. Okay, can I get more than five of them with this? I can get all of them with that. And it basically didn't even cost CP. Actually, let's do that. Actually, let's do that. Hopefully, by the time the egg explodes, it'll be far enough away from me. Why, Zen? Why must you not have any multi-target crafts? Oh, uh, let's see. We'll hit the moth, I guess. Yeah, go for him. He's tanky. Cluster nice and close together so that I can get you with magic. Yeah, somebody's definitely going to take an explosion, but oh well. Let's see, what do I want to use on these? Pretty much anything, but water will be less effective. Okay, how about one of these? It says arts are ineffective, but it doesn't say anything about non-elemental ones. Of course, now I can't tell if that'll actually hit. did, okay. 
and actually was out of the radius this time. Oh, I didn't see there's one left. Okay, well... Aren't you special, Mr. Crab? You get a Hellgate all to yourself. And three level ups, wow. Maxed out the Fire Sepith. And we get a Gladiator headband, nice. Back for more? Nah, just for your dulcet tones. So let's see. Skull pendant, out of your belt, out of your headband. Oh, how about Zin? Gladiator headband, CP up plus 10%. So wait a minute, that's my second one of those? Huh. I am not used to games giving you more than one of the, uh, of the same gladiator item. Well, I can't complain. And we get a tier of all? Treasure doesn't respawn, you know. Yeah, I know. Crab. That. They're probably too far apart to be worth using much magic on. And since she has a Sepitha bonus, we might as well do this. I don't recall that these actually drop any useful items. Or useful Sepith, I mean. Yeah, that was a waste of an aerial. I definitely should have placed that better. I was thinking, oh, they'll come to me, so I'll put it toward my party. Well, not if I get the casting off before they do. Yeah, the, the turn display bar can sometimes be a little misleading. Oh, hello, crab. How about... Hmm, not necessary. I really want to actually... I think this is an instance where I won't have those extra turns. Aw, oh, you missed a critical. Come to Papa. Or Mama, or whatever. Don't mind Joshua and Zinn, they're just standing in the middle of a powerful magic spell that their allies are casting. Gosh, is there anything in here except crabs? Might have to start skipping battles here. And Zane, you just present yourself as a tempting target that probably won't matter. Have a shower, Zin. Savor the victory. We earn it. Whoops. Actually, didn't mean to run into that one. So many crabs. I can just barely get both of them with that. Unless, of course, I miss. Huh. 
Geez, accuracy is only supposed to be a problem in the early game. Especially against big, slow crabs. Like, I can understand missing... Missing something like a swarm of bugs. Oh well. I'm just whining at this point. So what does he say there? Nighty night... Something. Nighty night princess? So wait a minute. Did we just go in a circle? Well, a square, but... Um... Now I'm confused. Okay, that goes absolutely nowhere. That is where we came from before, so yeah, it is just a big loop. And we already went that way, so that leaves one path left. That leaves one path, that's kind of redundant. Crab. Are the later games this bad about having a lack of enemy diversity? Oh, it's too bad he doesn't have Varial. Here, have a rock. You want a rock? Yeah, that worked nicely. Yeah, the sewer dungeons in Gruntel are not particularly hard, but they're not particularly interesting either. Well, let's get some healing. Should have just done a tier there. Oh well. Um, that's where we came from, isn't it? See how easy it is to get turned around. Or maybe I'm just bad at directions. I could certainly believe that. Ignoring that crab because we don't need to worry about it. Ah, uh, that was bad. Well, shoot. And we have another egg. I can only hit two of them with that. Guess we should have just fought it. How about one of these? Again, I can only hit two of them, but whatever. Get away. It's the craft for social distancing. Speaking of social distancing. And we'll do... Really? I can't hit both of them with that? Okay. Well, I'll have a squirt gun. Yeah, that wasn't elegant, but it worked. And boy, they are being stingy with the time sepith. Let's 
go ahead and heal everyone a bit. Probably didn't need that second one, but oh well. So let's see, that's where we came from. That's a dead end. Crab. Let's do that. Ooh, if I could only get that one turn sooner. You just hit it with the stick. That's frustrating. Well, if I get the petrify, it'll work. And I didn't. Okay. Bummer. At least it didn't look like I lost any time, Sephith, but... You know, I wish this game would tell you what the power of each of your attacks is. Yeah, blow up nice and far away from me. That is another thing that they changed in later games. It'd be nice if it would tell you the exact math, like, oh, this move has, you know, two times your attack power plus 43. Okay, we can go down or we can go across. Let's do this way. Go this way, whatever. Hey, something that's not a crab, it's amazing. Wouldn't it be nice if Zen could just shield everyone else from the blast. Like, how do you get that scar? Oh, I threw myself on an egg to, pro to protect my allies. Gosh, maybe we should have gone down. Yeah, okay, I changed my mind. Let's actually go the other way. We're gonna have to do both of them anyway if we want to complete the crossword, and that was bad. That ought to take care of the crabs anyway. Yeah, yeah. Attack guard, just hit it with the stick. Ow. Savor the victory. We are. So what is down in the basement? Yeah, I said I wasn't going to fight all the enemies, and apparently the enemies didn't like that suggestion. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, just 
pass. Pretty convenient how those things self-destruct on you if you get close on them, but they're resistant to magic and I only have one character who has ranged normal attacks. Good design there. Not. Okay, this way is where we were going. And that leads to another monster chest, okay. And it's more eggs. Second verse, same as the first. Do we have to have Zinn as team captain? Why can't we have Chloe instead? It seemed to have divided it seems to have divided up the enemies pretty nicely, but I didn't really want that. Men on the left, women on the right, non-binary people arrive up from the middle to conquer all. Yeah, this is definitely not working out as well as the last one did. And they really don't like Estelle. I mean, to be fair, sometimes neither do I, but that's just for her craft selection. I forgot she had Impede, or... another one of those. Alright, no egg explosions today. Ooh, I didn't realize how low Estelle was on HP. And he can't, he doesn't heal. Well, we have him, might as well use him. And no more crab. Okay, what sort of goodies do we get this time? You get Hawkeye. There's a note inside it reads, Haha, I knew you'd be back! Okay, so how exactly do we equip one of the Avengers? Okay, it is a weapon for him. Well, congratulations! You have a gun that was found in a sewer. Now we take the other path. I'm still not sure why they do the thing with the blackness at the end of the pathway, uh, pathway sometimes. Like, I think it could be to disguise a loading screen, but there's not much to load in either of these rooms. They're just tiny little... Yeah, I don't know. Got nothing. Okay. How about that away? How about the other way? I'm 
apparently too many pathways here. Oh, that looks sufficiently intimidating. Let's fight it. Let's heal first. Alright, we are fighting a bonefish. A heteromorphous monster looking in the, lurking in the darkness. It freezes foes with its cold breath and it's weak to fire. Which I don't think I will be able to take advantage of. Here's the part where I hope to get lucky with the status effects, because I don't know if anyone in my team is immune to freeze. Eh, well, Olivier certainly isn't. Can I just say, ow? White Gehenna the Jerks. Let's see. There we go. I have a wine steamed egg. Another recipe we can learn. Go ahead and do one of those. And miss. Thank you for not doing much. Now die! Yeah, that's her impede craft, so I must have forgotten that she already had an impede quartz. I could do that, but... Actually, which one of, one of them is about to go? That one, okay, and I can't kill it in one turn. So we'll have that go off after that one goes. And it did absolutely nothing, okay. Well, I will stare at you angrily. Got one of them. Okay, which of them has approximately 500 HP? That one. Extra strong punch. And of course it didn't do as much as I wanted. But this should finish him. Yeah, so definitely the most dangerous part of that fight was right at the beginning. And despite them using Freeze, they did not drop any Water Sepeth. That makes sense. Right, we got him. Now what were they guarding? A switch. So that should make it possible to go between the east and west blocks of the sewers. Now let's take the path that we didn't before. Okay, and that just leads back there. And now we go this way. Okay. And we have another monster chest with more eggs. Third verse, same as the first. The monster chester homogenous goodness. Ah! 
Yeah, I think it was a good decision giving Olivier that auto CP regen. I do wish he would quit missing stuff, though. I hate to belabor the point, but why on earth does Zen not have any multi-target crafts? Well, I distinctly remember him ha at least having one with a small area of effect in later games, so... Maybe he just gets one really late in this one. Let's do that. The pattern of enemies right now is not really very well suited for um, attacking more than one at once. Use your monk training to absorb that explosion. I don't know if that makes any sort of sense, but whatever. Okay, everything is down except the crabs. Thank you for going for the tank. Yeah, sorry if it feels like I don't have much in the way of commentary. There's just not much to commentate on. I'm trying to get water out of a stone here. I mean, like, there's almost no variety in enemy fights. I wonder if I should have saved. Oh well. I'll level up for Joshua, anyway. There's no story down here, either. And we get a Cestus. You look familiar. Weapon for... I'm not sure. Okay, for Zin. Make him even better at punching stuff. That could have been bad. Oh, well, that's something new. An enemy party with five. A new party of five? Whatever. More than just a crab in its platonic life partner. You do one of these. And you do one of these. That actually did more damage than was necessary, considering the aerial. Well, that'll wipe the field pretty nicely. Yeah, it sucks to have a triple 300% uh, vulnerability to every element, doesn't it? Hmm. Okay. Now, what's with these passages that don't go anywhere? Now we get a tear ball. The chest is so very, very, very empty crab that we don't need to bother with. So, hmm. There's still that one chest over there unaccounted for. So maybe we actually need to take that switch path. Let's just try that. This way? Okay, yeah, where does this go? Ok, 
Okay, that does just lead back into the other half of the sewers. Hmm. So how do we get that other chest, I wonder? I assume there wasn't anything else this way. Because we've already been here. And gotten that chest. That way is where we just were. Have we gone that way? That's where we came from, isn't it? So how the heck do we get to the other chest? Again, I wish that had popped one turn later. That's that. Let's move out. So if we go down here again... I also wish the enemies would quit respawning. Okay, so that just leads there. How very curious. That goes nowhere. Maybe one of those suspicious looking walls was actually fake? Well, it's the only suggestion I have. Only theory, whatever. Ah, that was dumb. And this time we get surprise attacked by surprise attacked by five of them, and I forgot to heal Estelle beforehand. How unfortunate. Good thing they can't aim for crap. Mind the phone alarm, it'll just add a little bit of something, I don't know. I don't know what it'll add, but it'll add a little bit of variety. We'll do another of these. It just looks like you should be able to do something with those walls. That goes nowhere. What am I missing here? I already went that way. Unless I'm actually supposed to go back to the western half of the sewers and get it from there? There's nothing there.
That goes nowhere. Okay, you know what? I've wasted you guys' time long enough. I'm just gonna look it up off camera. Okay, so apparently you actually can't get that chest right now. There's one more part of the sewers that you gain access to later in the game, and when you go down there, then you can get that chest. So, I was wandering around trying to figure that out for nothing. Maybe they should have put it in a different place so it wouldn't confuse people so much. It certainly confused me. Well, I guess that's the sewers done anyway, for now. So, I think next up we'll just be going back to the arena. So we'll see you then.